Chris Phantom here. This car is in here for a battery and actually two batteries. And we're doing a starter. Starter is bad. Let's go see what Javier's up to. So it took us a while to get from back there all the way to here. This is a very long car. Oh, what are, what we, are doing? we doing? We're, doing we're changing the starter. We're changing starter, okay. We're replacing the starter. How long do you think on this thing? Uh, this thing is super nice, man. There's not one oil leak on this car. Look at this. Clean. It's nice. You don't see a lot of these. This nice. Nice. How long? What do you think? Five, six, seven, eight hours, 24 hours, one day, two days? Say something. Uh, five hours. Okay, five hours. So Javier's five hours is most likely about eight hours. So <laughs> okay. stay tuned for this one. As soon as we're done, we'll take it out for a drive, make sure we're okay in this beautiful Phantom. Okay. Yeah, down. He's gonna take a picture with Moses with his mask on. Moses, that's the only time I see the whole trip, Moses. We come right remember yes, to see sir. you, Moses. Well, he's a bad motherfucker. Vic's all, all over the place. Yeah. He's either throwing pens or he's eating or he's talking to an insurance company. Hey, stop, stop letting him beat you up, man, and do all the pranks <laughs> on your ass, man. I'm getting old, I can't afford this. <laughs> Appreciate it, Moses. Hey, man. don't rip it. I spent a lot of time with it. Straight across. <laughs> Oh, it's dangerous. Hold on. You gotta look. look. <laughs> oh. Oh. Yeah, can you transfer me to Bugatti, please? Yes, Bugatti wholesale parts, yeah. I need brakes for my car. It's time already. I'm calling for my own car. Oh, after it comes back from Starlight? Yeah. <laughs> Isn't a brake order like 20 Six grand? Six pence a roll. Each, a, 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 I think a tire, a set of tires and TPMS is like $30,000. Hello, this is Moses from RDV. Um, I need some parts, pricing, and availability for a Bugatti. So please, if you can call us back, thank you. Moses, when you call a Bugatti dealer, you don't have to tell them you need parts for a Bugatti. That's all that they sell. Bro, I, this, it smells like fruit punch over here. <laughs> you show them, explain it, explain it, explain it. It's a new air freshener, what are you doing? This is good. This, this is the best one? Sorry. No? <laughs> what about this one? Show them this one. Smell this one. What about this one? That one? Mm -hmm. Oh, this one's good? Mm. This one's good. Mm. Chief keeps yours. It's good. Mm. Yeah, this one. Mm. This is not bad. This one, this one I like too, yeah. honestly. Well, I bad. like this one. I don't like this one that much. This is terrible. This one, tell him to just get, just take it away, like throw it away. <laughs> this smells like Universal Studios bathroom. Yeah, discontinue this one. It's terrible. <laughs> discontinue. We just got it in. Oh. This is Moses' favorite. That's so good. If you want to smell, if you want to smell like Moses, Moses' car. Oh, it's really. It, it does smell good. It does. It does. I like the smell a lot. It's a good actually. One. We have this Rolls Royce Phantom, and you guys know we're doing a starter. Javier, Javier's putting the bottom cover in already. The new part. The new parts are in, the new parts are sold. Uh, this is the old starter. So this starter looks pretty, uh, pretty old. So I, I don't know how old this thing is, but yeah, we have the brand new one in there. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and test it, make sure we're good to go, and that's it. And yeah, I like the hair. It reminds me of the old days. What do you think about the hair, Sarkis? Nice. I think he looks good bald. Yeah. <laughs> no, I like bald. The bald, his bald, the bald look looks better on him. Thank you. It's so funny, we're so professional in the beginning and then we start acting like idiots after we're done explaining the videos. But this car's been sitting for a while. Um, owner hasn't been driving this thing for a while, so it does have about 42,000 miles on this car. This 2006 Phantom, believe it or not, is perfect it's in perfect condition it's just whatever we did it's like just regular wear and tear you know every car goes through it but other than that this car has absolutely no zero leaks there's no leaks whatsoever it's beautiful it drives like a dream there is nothing wrong with this car interior exterior perfectly clean customer has uh kept this thing very clean so we're just on a test drive to make sure there's no sounds even with suspension make sure everything's okay maybe one day i'll probably get one of these yeah right Alright guys, 
Baba Bentega here. This belongs to Future the Rapper. This was wrapped about two years ago in deep matte black, actually. It's not satin black. This fender was, uh, I guess they hit it in this area right here. It was dented up. We went ahead and fixed it, painted it, let it dry, and now we rewrapped this fender only. So that's why it's missing the lights and all that stuff. We're gonna be putting that all back together, and this car's back to good condition. And that's it for another Bentega. I was just now asking for this material. Oh, really? Yes, because this one's hot. Yeah, that one's a little better. Try it. Oh, I'm a hunt. I already know. I know the material, man. You're spot on. Soft, it, dude, it gets breathable. Yeah, yeah. Whereas that cotton, it yeah, messed your face. So I just put it on because I didn't have one. Yeah. Bam. Keeping it COVID clean. <laughs> So this is Moses' new car. He likes fruits, so we uh, painted a bunch of fruits on his car. but we are in this insane Camaro SS. This thing drives really, really nice. Super powerful, clutch is insane. I haven't driven a car like this for a long time. I must say I'm super impressed. This makes you appreciate cars, honestly. It's ridiculously loud, it pops, it does all the noises that you would want it to make. Honestly, it's way too loud. I think I'm in love with this car. Old classic Camaro with working air conditioning, of course. Pretty rare for a car like this. This car's clutch was, as you guys remember, I don't know if you guys remember, we pushed it in the shop. Repairs good, customers coming later to pick it up. Yeah, I didn't go on the test drive with Vape because I don't trust two things. One, he drives super fast. And two, this is a very fast car with a lot of power. So those two things, yeah, I'm, I'm afraid to sit in the passenger seat. So I'm, I, I didn't do it. And Sarkis didn't even go with them. It was Vic on his own on this one, so, but. He doesn't like to be filmed, but he has no idea. We're, filmed, we're, we're actually trying to get the car, not him. So we have to be very quiet, because when he gets pissed, he starts to throw things, and yeah, it's pretty bad. So we're trying to be as nice as possible, right, John? <laughs> special Lamborghini behind us right here. It's special because it's called the special edition. Only 250 of these were made. This is number 171. One owner car, very, very clean. It's in balloon white originally. Customers owned it forever. Uh, doesn't drive it too much. Wanted to change it up a little bit. So we wrapped it this really, really awesome metallic satin blue color. Everything else is stock. We're gonna keep that two-tone black on there, factory-like. Obviously, the older these Lamborghinis get, they look cooler. Even though the Gardos had a lot of eager problems, I remember I used to drive them. It's got a black and white interior as well. We're gonna finish it up, put the wheels, all that stuff, and then it's ready. 